Hello, hi guys, it's Adam here with the Samsung Galaxy S5 and we're going to be taking a look at the Project Extreme SX Titanium series of cases for the Galaxy S5. As ever, links will be down in the description box below if you're after one and as it says on the tin, this is made from anodized titanium. So we'll just get this out of the box here, nothing else in there. We do also get a screen protector with it, so we'll have a look in that in just one second. So we get kind of like a key, which we'll use to unlock the screws on the side of this case, if I can even get it out of its casing even. Oh, there we go. Finally got it out, it's really stuck in there. So we'll leave that to one side. You can see the faint lines going through this bumper case. As you can see, it's not going to be covering the front or back of the unit. That's why they've given us some screen protectors. Around the top, you've got the cutouts there for the infrared sensors, as well as the 3.5 millimeter audio jack. And the buttons are pretty big. Definitely a metal feel, not the standard plastic and back around to the bottom the polished metal edge just shining away here with that substantial gap where the data transfer and charging cover is meant to fit and there's two hex screws that you need to be able to unscrew one is towards the bottom left uh, of this bumper case and the other is towards the top right again using a hex screwdriver that accompanies this bumper case and if I just bring that into shot here you just unscrew it and you use this to open up the case. Before we put the bumper case on we'll have a look at the screen protector HD silicon screen technology as it states on the front of the packaging here so let's see if I can actually get this open and that does absolutely nothing whatsoever so let's get it open from the bottom here and there we go that also is not very good at actually opening what I want so we're just gonna have to rip this open and it just falls apart so excellent so we'll just get this out here they give you a cleaning cloth some instructions as well as two screen protectors in case you screw it up pretty straightforward really remove the tab which is labeled step one I only tend to remove it about halfway down so you can align up the buttons so we'll begin here with the bottom and then as you get it laid, you can slowly peel off the rest of the screen protector, like so. And using the cloth that came with it, just push out any air bubbles from the center outwards here. Now, before we get the screws open on this bumper case, I just wanted to show you the soft touch material that's along the inside of this bumper case, just to stop your device from getting scratched by its titanium material. So what we'll do is uh, bring in the hex screwdriver and hopefully get one of these screws out. It can be a little bit fiddly, but there we go. Hopefully we can get away with just getting one of the screws out. So we'll bring in the Galaxy S5. I'll get rid of the second strip that we've got on the top here and see if we can slide it in while expanding the sides of uh, the case. So there we go, that's gone in there. Slide it in a little bit and then clip in the bottom sides like so. And see if we can get the screw back in now. As I say, they are quite small, so it can be a little bit fiddly. See how easily this goes in. Once you've got it in, it's a really nice fit and not likely to slide out at all, scripping the sides really, really well. The buttons, you do get a significant click to those once they're being pressed and they work absolutely fine. Looks pretty cool with these curved contours going up and around the side of your device and coupled with that shiny polished metal feel around the edges it does look futuristic and certainly different to what else is out on the market but for me holding it in your hand like so these edges towards the bottom here are way too sharp and I can see this getting on my nerves for extended periods of time the screen protector seems pretty standard for what it is as it's a bumper case 
you would expect something for the screen to be provided which they have and the screen looks stunning as ever the only thing that i will mention is if i hold one end of the screwdriver here you'll notice the other end spins completely freely so the workmanship on this screwdriver alone is pretty poor it's lucky that i've got my own set of screwdrivers that i can use to eventually get off this sx titanium series case from project extreme it looks really cool i'll give it that and there's no doubt that it will protect your device when it falls on its edge but day-to-day -day use we'll see how it performs because already i'm finding it really annoying how sharp these bottom edges are and to be fair the edges around the sides are pretty sharp as well but do let me know in the comments section down below what you think would you buy this case just purely on looks alone and do you think even if it looks that good compared to other plastic bumper cases for this device as ever any comments or questions you guys have got hit them up in the comments section down below there or hit me up on social media twitter and instagram at inamka4 i do post up a lot of photographs over on instagram from bearing devices so do check me out over there and if you found this video informative and helpful do give us a thumbs up and if you're new and want to tag along hit that subscribe button just down there it doesn't cost you a single penny and you can also check out some of our forthcoming videos thanks for watching have a wicked day and we'll see you next time